Howdy, folks. Well, here's a reality that might be the last time you hear that this year. We are saying so long to Big Tex and the State Fair of Texas this very weekend. Sunday, tomorrow is your last day to enjoy all the fun that the fair has to offer. Our Alexis Wainwright shows us how some of the businesses and the fairgoers are feeling as it all wraps up. I've been coming all my life. For the 63rd year, Debbie Solis is attending the State Fair of Texas with family. I just love it. I love every time I come, I meet people, I see people. And I also love coming out here because you always bring someone and say, wow, I didn't know how good this food was. And just like we have family right here in the corner just enjoying the meal. It's her seventh time here this year. And the thing that keeps her coming back, okay. the food. People yes. like Solis are keeping food stands working hard. We've been extremely busy, like overwhelmingly busy. As a matter of fact, like I said, we basically closed our Arlington location um, just this week because we need all hands on deck. The owners of Shrimp Dog continue to add more help to serve the crowds that have been raving about their dishes. Yeah, there you go. The flavored fried shrimp baskets and the blackened shrimp loaded baked potato. Each year has gotten better and better for us, so it's a great, great situation to have. We work hard and, you know, we're, the gratification comes with being able to provide a product that people look forward to. Another fan favorite. So this is the tacos campeones that we create for the state fair. It's con tortilla, fresh guacamole, carne asada, pico de gallo and cotija cheese. I just love the food. Authentic, delicious. And the list of places goes on. And these are the gorditas, and we make them fresh out of masa. And well, when they ask me, what's a gordita? I say, it's like a peanut pocket. You know, open it and stuff it, whatever you like. Yes, there's rides and games, but majority of the people we spoke to say they're focusing their last trip on the food. We have family visiting from Tennessee, so that's why we specifically came today to join um, for our last visit here. Alexis Wainwright, CBS News, Texas. Well, folks, if you can't see Big Tex for this last weekend, you can relive some of that State Fair magic on our website. From the new rides to the Big Tex Choice Awards and so much more, you can find those stories on CBSNewsTexas.com.